If this is the first time you are visiting our channel, please make sure you hit the subscribe button. Hydrogen is the simplest element and the most abundant substance in the universe. When hydrogen burns, it generates energy in the form of heat, with water as a byproduct. That means energy created from hydrogen generates no atmosphere warming carbon dioxide, making it one of many potential energy carriers that could help reduce carbon emissions and slow global warming. It should be noted that hydrogen is not a source of energy such as oil, coal, solar, or wind, because it is not possible to find it or extract it from somewhere in the universe. The same as electricity, hydrogen is an energy carrier. It means it must be generated from a source of energy such as wind, solar, coal, natural gas, or other resources. But creating hydrogen and transforming it into a useful format requires energy, and that energy is not necessarily renewable. That process is also inefficient and expensive compared with other forms of energy, renewable or not. If you want us to make this kind of video, make sure you comment below and do not forget to subscribe. Producing hydrogen takes energy because hydrogen atoms don't exist on their own, they are almost always stuck to another atom, often another element. On Earth, hydrogen is particularly abundant in the form of water. Creating pure hydrogen requires breaking those molecular bonds. In the energy business, people refer to hydrogen by an array of colors as shorthand for how it was created. Blue hydrogen is hydrogen produced from natural gas with a process of steam methane reforming, where natural gas is mixed with very hot steam and a catalyst. A chemical reaction occurs, creating hydrogen and carbon monoxide. Water is added to that mixture, turning the carbon monoxide into carbon dioxide and more hydrogen in a process called the water gas shift reaction. If the carbon dioxide emissions are then captured and stored underground, the process is considered carbon neutral, and the resulting hydrogen is called blue hydrogen. More than 80% of the produced hydrogen in the world is derived from the steam methane reforming method, which is significantly higher than the electrolysis process. In the steam methane reforming method, natural gas is initially cleaned of impurities. To remove sulfur, that can retard hydrogen production, from natural gas, hydrodesulfurization and adsorption techniques with activated carbon are used. The purified natural gas product is mixed with steam and passed over an extremely high temperature reactor where hydrogen and carbon monoxide are produced. A well-established and least expensive method to produce hydrogen fuel is steam methane reforming, with a conversion efficiency between 74 to 85 percent. Gray hydrogen is made from natural gas reforming like blue hydrogen, but without any efforts to capture carbon dioxide byproducts. Therefore, against blue hydrogen, gray hydrogen is not clean and an environmentally friendly fuel. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification.